Hi, um, Stephen Tilly, architect. You're the architect for the project, and uh, you're down here today to look at the building. I am indeed. Yeah, right. And, yeah. and uh, what interesting things have you seen? Well, uh, <laughs> from bottom to top, um, I'm happy to see the bracing and the, uh, and the uh, uh, kind of everything, the, the uh, cross bridging and so on in good shape. And uh, the new basement door is very exciting yeah. development. And the fact that uh, nothing has shifted dramatically is <laughs> always a good thing. Yeah. And um, that the, uh, the bracing is in shape all the way up through the top of the building. Um, and um, it, it, so the signs of progress yeah. it, uh, are always, uh, always encouraging. And I mean, obviously the building is still in tough shape and I'm still concerned and it would great to take the next steps and get uh, uh, start moving on going from emergency bracing to ensuring to actually starting to yeah. pull the fabric and the building back together yeah. but um, but this is a really important step um, and it's four years later yeah um, and uh, but it's done yeah and, uh, there's a lot, a lot of exciting things have happened in terms of both, uh, you know, from the initial um, uh, work with the building where all the lot got cleaned up and everything and where all the rubbish got moved out of the building and, you know, historic uh, features, uh, elements, stores and things like that were identified. And, and of course, they've been sort of, you know, set here and there for the uh, construction. Right. Um, and then you've got uh, bracing in the back. It sounds like you're getting ready for winter because you've got the scaffold or the um, plastic covering up on the, the back part of the building. And right. Yeah, no, to get a little enclosure and to get a little heat in the building to reduce the humidity levels and to um, also stop ice lenses from forming in the brick and the process of further deterioration this yeah. winter. So we're hopeful that then... Um, between the shoring and a little bit of heat that uh, will sustain it through the winter and then can continue yeah. to make progress next uh, the next season. Yeah, a lot of times people are quick to say, oh, you're doing a, a renovation on the building and obviously it's much more complicated than that. This is, um, it's kind of like a root canal and then reconstruction because we've got to go in and do uh, remove a lot of stuff in order to see what the conditions are, in order to keep the building from moving around, and then come back and do some reconstruction. So we've got every category, if you want to use the official categories, from um, restoration through reconstruction and rehabilitation, which, are, yeah. which all have different meanings technically, but it's, um, it's going to take a combination of everything, uh, conserving what's here, reconstructing some things that aren't here, and rehabilitating for new uses for for the uh, workshop and its purposes, which um, will be uh, adapting the building to those yeah. important new uses. All right. Thanks very much. Sure. Okay. All right.